All right, what are we doing? What I do know, he's got a base under him now. He wants the ball in his hands. His craft is good. His craft is good around stoppage. Is that the right thing to do? Is the unit put there and going, well, guys, we, we're not getting the ball movement we need? Match committee is made up of, obviously, the line coaches, development coaches. What we're looking for is a... Uh, representation from our development coaches as far as how our younger guys are going or our players normally play in the, in the SNFL. Most of our coaches get out to those games as well so it's uh, coming together there with the decision around who's putting their hand up um, and who deserves to play at the higher level um, and then also comparing that to how we're performing at that higher level. Had a little thing, Mick had a good couple of meetings, good chats. Are you comfortable are you, are you comfortable? You've watched the last one? It's all about discussion, it's about um, you know, no idea is wrong. You know, throw up what you feel, how you feel the group's going. It's all about making us better. And some of that's not, not necessarily all on form. It's about the balance of the side. You know, if we're looking for, for more run from half back, how do we create that? Seedsman with a back pedal. That'll work. Smith got it back again. Down to 40 seconds. Seedsman's had a couple of chances. Breaks through Gleason. Loads up. Goes on. If we're looking for more size in our forward half, um, you know, who do we go to to get that as well? Last of long for four tests. You know, we're spending a fair bit of time looking at what balance we've got within our group, uh, both of experience versus youth, um, also run versus contest. Um, you know, it's constantly looking at those dynamics and, and working with them. Bringing some youth and experience. You prefer the first one? Yep. yep. Oh, I just think we're not dominating soon yep. about. There's a number of different challenges. There's also the opposition that, you know, it's really important to understand what's coming in that next game. What, what are the opposition bringing? What are their weapons? Uh, and making sure we've got answers for those. I, I understand what you're saying, but why should they? The devil's advocate in the room is always a good one. Just to throw up an idea or thought. I think it's a huge benefit to have different characters, different personalities in the room uh, with different thoughts and ideas.